Hey friends, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use the hint field. Here there's a basic card, it's a question answer front and back, nothing fancy. Let's head on over here to um, tools and click manage node types. And you can see there are three node types and what we're going to do is click on add and we're going to use the basic and then we're going to give it a name. So let's call this basic with hint. Bam. And it has zero nodes and we're going to use it. Let's switch to browse here. Here's our card. So let's select it and um, change the node type. And we're going to pick the basic with hint 2022. And nothing really changed here. It looks the same, but if we click the fields, we can add a new field and we'll call this hint. And let's add a hint. It's uh, not tango, but dot, dot, dot. And uh, if we click on the preview, it's still not there. And that's because we need to update the markup, which we can do by hitting cards and going into either the front or the back. It depends on where you want the hint, but write this markup and uh, hint colon and then the field name. In our case, it's just called hint, but you could use another field and then it shows up here, right? And you can add it to the back as well if you wanted to. I don't see why we would do that, but uh, just as an example, you can see then it shows up there. And if you want to style it, um, you can just target the hint uh, class. And for example, set the color to uh, purple, uh, font size to, um, yeah, let's say, uh, two RAM, if you want to make it that huge for some reason, or, or even smaller, 0.2, right? No, actually, that's too small. Let's make it uh, 0.5, there. Now you see it's very small, hidden away, right? And um, if we now look at the preview and you click the hint, it will show. So it won't show unless you click it, right? So that's how you uh, use hints in uh, Anki. Thank you for watching and please do like and subscribe.